Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you my monthly favorites and I'm actually really excited to show you um, the products that I've been really liking this month as well as some style and one style item, <clears throat> a book and songs and a movie. So those are just going to be around but I guess I'm going to go ahead and start showing you the beauty products that I've been really liking this month and yeah I'm just really happy right now because I just finished eating. And I've been trying to edit this video for the longest and not edit but like film it and I got really hungry and it's already like 5 o'clock and it was like my first time eating because so I like I never eat breakfast. But anyways, enough about that. I'm just going to go ahead and start. <laughs> so anyways, um, the first product I'm going to show you is my Rimmel London lipstick and it's in the color 642 New Delight and it's the color, it's the color that I'm actually wearing right now. It's a really nice mauvey peachy nude color and it's really really pretty and I really like it I really like it it's my go-to lipstick right now and it doesn't make me look dead or anything and I feel like it complements my skin tone and it's a really pretty color and I really like it a lot okay next I'm just gonna be showing you the two mascaras that I actually been loving a lot I couldn't decide on which one I liked but um they're both by Maybelline and this one is the Rocket Volume Express Mascara and then this one is the Mega Plush Volume Express Mascara and this one has like a really bendy brush and I really really like this mascara a lot I don't know I feel like it works the way it's supposed to and it doesn't clump up my lashes or anything like that if you do use like a lighter hand on it another mascara that I've been really liking a lot is the Maybelline Rocket Volume Express Mascara this one the brush is not like that it's really you know good and I really like it and both of them have um, a plastic applicators and it's a really good mascara you can probably hear one direction in the back and that's because my little sister is like obsessed with them and she's probably listening to them right now and I told her to turn down the music but she's not gonna listen to me so yeah anyways those are the two mascaras that I've been really liking this month. Okay, next I'm going to be showing you my um, two face products that I've been using a lot. And one of them is a blush and the other one's a bronzer. First of all, this is the bronzer that I've been uh, going to a lot. It's the NYC Bronzer in Sunny. And I know Ms. Glamorati raves about this a lot. And I can see why. This is a really basic matte perfect shade bronzer I guess I would say and it would work for um, lighter complexions also and it's a really pretty bronzy color obviously it's like um, orange brown you know it's a bronzer you know ah oh, why did I keep saying you know but anyways it's a bronzer and I really like it and I honestly have to say that this is my favorite bronzer out of my little makeup collection that I have this is what I go for all the time the blush that I've been really liking this month it's just a matte um, blush because it has no shimmer in it and it's the Revlon powder blush and it's in the color smoky rose and it kind of looks like my lips but honestly this is a little bit more pinky tone which this is a little more um peachy toned but um it's a really pretty color and I've been really liking it a lot and I've been wearing it a lot in this month and next I'm going to be showing you two brushes that I've been actually using a lot 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 and this is the deluxe crease brush and this is from the starter I set for real techniques I think that's the name of it and I just got these recently but I've been really liking this for my eyeshadow it works really really good and um, <clears throat> I've also been liking this when I do use my MAC Pro Longwear concealer I do like blending blending it in with this brush instead of using my fingers for some reason and then the other brush is also the a real techniques brush and this one is from the core collection and I use this brush. This is a buffing brush. I mean, I think this is really good for applying liquid foundation, you know, and using it all over your face. But um, I've been using this brush to blend in um, my bronzer and my blush, you know, to make it look a little bit more natural on my face. And I know Nicole Guerrero, she uses a stippling brush by Sigma, I believe. And she uses that. And I was like, I don't have a stippling brush, you know, the one that I had. I don't know what happened to it, but I lost it. So I was like, I'm just going to go ahead and try the buffing brush. And, you know, it works out really well. And it's a really good soft brush. And, 
yeah that is pretty much all i have to say about it next i'm gonna be showing you guys a book i have a phone call hello oh <laughs> hello i'm filming can you like call me later because i'm filming Oh, yes. Okay. I'll do that. Okay, bye. Sorry. Bye. Okay, um, yeah. Anyways, um, what was I talking about? Okay, my favorite book, which has been my favorite book for the past, what, three and a half months also, and I'm still looking at it. It's a true with Whitney Port book by with Cheryl Burke, and... It's a really amazing book. I really like it. It talks about style, living life to the fullest, taking chances, staying in shape, relationships, career success, and even some decor in here. And when I read through this book, you know, I feel like it inspired me more to make my YouTube channel because, you know, a lot of this stuff is what I want to bring out there to you guys as well as, you know, some parts of me. Like, because I think I'm really funny. I think kind of sort of I'm a little bit funny and I did want to make some like um, videos with challenges and you know crazy stuff like that vlogs because I feel like uh, I feel like they would be entertaining but I'm not sure yet I feel like I still have to get comfortable with myself and the camera and vlogging and all that stuff but anyways back to the book I really like this book and it gives you some really good you know inspiration it gives you some really good um, advice and I highly recommend this book. It's a really good book. Also, I was a big fan of The Hills, The City, and Laguna Beach. So, yeah, she's definitely one of my role models. And <clears throat> I recommend the book. So, yeah. Okay, this, my style, the thing that I chose for my little style category thing, I just went ahead and chose leggings. Because I really love leggings. And... I feel like I serve, they helped me survive through the spring semester of college because cr Texas is crazy. Like the weather is so bipolar here, it is not even funny. Like it can be hot one day, super cold one day, rainy the next day. There's some, I don't know, we get all the weather like every, oh, it's different weather every day. So um, yeah, I love leggings. So that's what I chose because I feel like I wore them a lot during the spring and a lot this month. Yeah, but um, yeah, anyways, I'm gonna talk about my favorite movie this month was a movie called Oblivion And I'm gonna actually look up like a little bit. I can't really describe it because it was just such a good movie and um The protagonist was Tom Cruise and yeah, it's about a I know I got a text message. Okay, it's about a man and he's like repair stuff it's very like fu very futuristic it's a little bit complicated it has a little bit of suspense and it's a little bit mind-boggling like you're all confused at one point and then like bam it hits you and then bam again and then you're like oh my gosh and then i even got a little bit teary died at one point and um <laughs> you're probably like what is she talking about but i promise it's a really good movie and if you guys have read it or anything like that you can leave a comment down below saying why you liked it or something like that or I don't know but um the two songs that I've been really liking this month one of them is um Lana Del Rey Young and Beautiful and why is my phone going crazy today I don't even know why but anyways one of the songs the song that I've been really liking this month one of them is by Lana Del Rey it's Young and Beautiful and I know that song is also in the Great Gatsby soundtrack because when I bought the song on iTunes that's I think that's what the that's a little background on it it that's a little background on it like let me show you what I'm talking about because you guys are like what is she talking about but uh, <laughs> um, yeah that's a background on it so that's part of the song but it's a really good song I really like it and I love Lana Del Rey she's definitely up there with my top favorite artist and the second song is Ashtrays and Heartbreaks by uh, Snoop Lion, which is also Snoop Dogg, you know, featuring Miley Cyrus, and I really like that song a lot. I don't know why. That was like a reggae feel to it, and I just really like it. 
it's definitely something I would not listen to like from the music that I like but when I heard that song that my cousin had mentioned she mentioned it to me and then I listened to it and I was like oh my god I really like it so I went ahead and bought it on iTunes but that pretty much concludes all my monthly favorites and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I know and I apologize that there is a lot of background noise but all my siblings are home from school and they're like in the living room which is right here in the front not here but like in the next room and then my little sister's room is over there and she's like blasting one direction so that pretty much concludes my favorites videos if you guys have any comments any questions any video requests if you guys have anything of that sort you can always leave them in the comment section below and i will reply to you if you uh, once again if it's more personal or anything like that you can message me here on youtube because you know we're all friends and um yeah if you like this video go ahead and give it a thumbs up if you guys want to see more of my videos because this is the first video you watch from my channel you can go ahead and subscribe to my channel because that would i would really appreciate it and that would mean a lot to me and yeah guys until next time thank you once again for watching and bye